Hi, this is David from Electric Teaching, and I'd like to show you how to use uh, a distribution property in a couple of problems here. The basic uh, instruction here is to collect like terms, to collect like terms. But to be able to collect any of the like terms, you're going to need to use distribution here. This is when we want to multiply the 5. The instruction for here is the 5 is to be multiplied to every term inside of the parentheses. Over here, the 9 is to be distributed, is to be multiplied to every term inside the, the parentheses. Terms are separated by plus or minus sign. So in case you didn't realize that, terms are separated by plus or minus sign. There are two terms here and two terms here and two terms here. So let's see, I got 5 times t, or 5t, 5 times a negative 7, negative 35, 9 times 5, the plus sign carries with the 9, so it's a plus 45, and a plus 9 times a plus uh, uh, t is going to be a positive, or a plus 9t. So this is how I've distributed. Now I'm going to do the collecting of like terms. This is collect like terms. I like to use... CLT is a little acronym to just kind of speed up the discussion. Technically, I'm using some uh, properties here where I'm moving them around in, um, by the uh, commutative and associative properties, but I think we can look at them as just what is collectible and what is not. These numbers are collectible, so the negative 35 and the positive 45 make a positive 10 sum, and the 5t and the 9t make a 14t. This is our final answer. On the next problem here, I have something that I refer to as negative distribution. Negative distribution. I often use the word negative distribution to emphasize don't lose that negative sign. Don't lose that negative sign that's there. So be very careful of the negative sign. So let's go ahead and distribute a negative 3. A negative 3 times u is just negative 3u. A negative 3 times a negative v will be a positive because of the negative times negative. 3v, and this is key. The parentheses stop right here. This plus 1 is not part of the multiplier. So do not distribute beyond the parentheses. Just bring down the next part. u and v are not collectible. They could be different values. u could be a million and v could be 1. So you can collect them and call them one, one item or zero them out because one's negative three and one's positive three. So let's go ahead and box that answer. I'm David from Electric Teaching. I hope that this has helped.